Hi, my name is Rebecca Bachoa. I'm from Slovakia, but I'm studying in Germany. My subject is called Geoecology. It's a perfect mixture of like physical geography, geology, and earth sciences and ecology. So I read about GeoIntern online when I was looking for a summer internship this winter and I was scrolling through several websites and as soon as I just wrote down Volcanology Internship, GeoIntern was I think the first one to pop up and I read about it and I liked everything about it. I was just like, this is absolutely perfect, this is what I was looking forward to. I applied for GeoIntern because I wanted a summer internship, I wanted to do in praxis what I learned in, at university and my dream was always to be a volcanologist and I, I just really wanted to try how it is, how it is to work as a volcanologist, how it is to really apply the learned skills. So the first week of Geo Intern, it was a combination of the science communication training with some first field trips. So we started with a few lectures just to get familiar with what are we going to do, how are we going to work and what's the plan, getting to know each other and having some good time. The second week of Geo Intern was uh, Hannah Little and Hannah was mostly focusing on video and filmmaking. So the second week we also focused on making a movie, um, also a documentary. We had over one documentary um, director, so we also watched his movies and talked with him and got to make a professional interview with him, which is posted on Volcano Stories. And um, yeah, so and in the end we also got to make our own movies ourselves. So whatever we were learning about, whatever we did here, and we got to process it and work on it. Uh, the third week of GRU intern was very different to the previous ones. This part, um, Richard Brown, a professor from UK, came here to Tenerife and we were working on his year-long research question about um, completing the Calderas eruptive history and working on trying to work out how many uh, plenian eruptions have been in Tenerife before and we were basically building on the work of previous year's students. So um, they found out about 10 eruptions, we found out about 12 new. So it was very interesting every day on a field from morning to afternoon to evening and visiting various pumice fall deposits, discussing questions and being together outside. So the final week of Geo Intern was very exciting as well. Um, it was very different every single day. The first two days we had um, geophysics like micro seismic survey with our local seismologist Pablo Gonzalez. The third day was um, also a field trip but um, to um, lava channels where we were measuring lava channels and when we went on a trip to La Real Forest which is a very unique ecosystem only found in like four places on earth. So it was um, also a bit of ecology and plants, including and endemic species. And then the Thursday was a tidal trip. We went on a big hike. Um, it really was amazing, spectacular giant volcano. Uh, the excursions we did on Geo Intern every Saturday were really amazing. Some of my absolute highlights of the of the whole program. Um, the first excursion was uh, whale and dolphin watching on Los Gigantes, which is an like incredibly huge cliff with unique nature. And we went swimming and just visiting the coast, and it was really beautiful. And then we also had an excursion to Lava Tube, so we went on a guided tour down there. Um, it was very interesting too and we did a coastal hike with swimming in rock pools so this island has so much to offer we could have stayed here forever. <laughs> Being a geo intern the whole month here, I think I've learned new things every single day. It was really amazing program with so many various things and places we've seen. I learned so much um, in science communication because we've never had a training like this ever before. So it was a lot new how to really write properly, how to being able to sum up things quickly and and so they make sense and how to write a blog post or really make a good interview. I really, um, really, really treasure everything I've learned here during the past month.